in this episode of Plant Life with Ashley Anita. I am here at Oakdale Nurseries, one of my favorite spots in Charlotte. They are absolutely packed. I will say this, I got super lucky today. They are packed full of inventory. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Wow, oh my gosh. I can't believe how much amazing stuff is here. Oh my goodness. This is just the first greenhouse. This is another one of their greenhouses. All right, let's do plant haul time. Love them all so much. All right. Hey guys, welcome back. So I'm really, really excited because I am here at Oakdale Nurseries, one of my favorite spots in Charlotte. It has been a really long time since I visited and I'm going to do some plant shopping today. Now, they've been posting all sorts of great stuff on their Instagram with all sorts of plants that they've been getting in. Now they have a wide, wide range of tropicals and succulents and cacti, lots of terrific houseplants, so I cannot wait to check them out. For those of you that don't know me, welcome. If you like houseplants, this channel's for you. We do all things houseplants. We go plant shopping. I do plant tours. I'm in the process of moving uh, up to 150 houseplants right now And I'm really excited to put that video out Hopefully this week for you guys all about how my move has been going kind of the process some plans are doing okay Some not so much, but I'm really excited to be finally able to share that with you guys It might end up being my least favorite video I've ever done uh I also just finished up a giveaway on my Instagram account. Congratulations to the winner who just won a beautiful Monstera Peru and also a gorgeous pot and planter that went along with that. So you may want to check out my Instagram if you enjoy that kind of thing. So without further ado, let's go do some plant shopping. They are absolutely packed. I've had days where I've come here before and I just so happened to get there the day before the big truck arrives. I will say this, I got super lucky today. They are packed full of inventory. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Wow, oh my gosh. I can't believe how much amazing stuff is here. <gasps> and I have to say right off the bat, the first thing that catches my eye are these beautiful um, holiday cactuses that they have here are cacti oh they are $16.95 look at the beautiful colors that they have I mean they have them all they have these beautiful white ones really healthy gorgeous gorgeous red scarlet ones they have some purple they also have the ones up here and these beautiful hanging baskets for $25 completely massive oh my goodness these Christmas cactus are absolutely beautiful and these are so wonderful because they bloom every holiday season depending what type you get. If you buy the Thanksgiving one, it will bloom around Thanksgiving. If you buy the Christmas one, it's at Christmas. And if you buy the Easter one, it will bloom around Easter. And the way that you can tell the difference between them is based on their leaf shape and uh, they are absolutely gorgeous. They are fast growing, easy care. I absolutely love these. I'm gonna get started over here. Look at all of these beautiful Maranta green prayer plants for $8.95, absolutely stunning. I just love the minty color of these leaves and they are actually pretty like velvety. I really, really like them. Here we have a peacock calathea for $19.95. 
One of the things I do really, really love about this greenhouse is that they label everything. They let you know exactly what type of plants you're buying. Everything is usually really healthy. Um, and it's always nice to know what you're looking at. Absolutely beautiful beauty star Calathea. Rattle snake Calathea or Calathea lancifolia. Calathea rose, roseo piccata dotty. Look at the beautiful pink on those leaves. Such a cute little peacock Calathea for $11.95. Calathea medallion. Over here we have Calathea mac macoyana, red maranta, ornata. Just an absolutely terrific selection. Ooh, some Stromanthi Trio Star for $19.95. Coming into the ZZs, always such a really, really great plant. These are 20. ZZ Zenzies, so cute for $24.95. Some nice staghorn ferns for $16.95. Philodendron Macaulay, $16.95. Look at that leaf color. Beautiful. Some Moonlight Philodendron, Philodendron Brazil. Look how neon this is. So, so pretty. $11.95. Oh my goodness. Here we have Calathea Setosa. And they have Alocasia Black Velvet, absolutely massive. Um, and I ended up losing my Alocasia Black Velvet to Thrips. I just decided not to chance it um, with my other plants. And I'm still giving it a chance, but I think I might buy another one of these today because I have to say it's one of my all-time favorite plants. I would admire it every day because look how stunning these are. And even my husband, who's not crazy into houseplants, was told me that's one of his favorites. So for $21.95, absolutely massive. Guys, I'm so excited to actually see these here. One of these is definitely on my list for today. They also have Ficus triangular. This is the only place I've ever seen these besides Lowe's and Home Depot with the Trending Tropicals collection, $34.95. They also have Ficus Audrey Stump. That's kind of cool. Look how um, full this one is. This Ficus Audrey for $29. I cannot stop staring at these Alocasia Black Velvets here. Look at it. And they're big. Here we have loads of fiddle leaf fig. This big one is $189 and these smaller ones are $40. This nice size one is $69. Absolutely beautiful. Look at these stunning maiden hair ferns for $14.95. So beautiful and delicate. Here we have an asparagus fern for $14.95. Some bird of paradise. This one's kind of different, a Monty Lemon. Here we have some rubber trees, Ficus Rubber Burgundy, $10.95. Here we have some larger size Bird of Paradise. This one is $1.69 and the other ones are $49.95. Here we have some really pretty Peperomia Frost, quite full for $14.95. Look at this gorgeous staghorn fern, absolutely just beautiful and I don't know what this is called I can't remember oh my gosh is that a little lizard hi bud <laughs> you chilling out oh see you later as I mentioned before they have everything labeled which is also really nice with their Sansevieria so here we have a Laurentii and Silver Flame. Look how beautiful that is with the variegation on that leaf. Just absolutely stunning for 29. And I love the dark 
um, just the dark green on these leaves and they even have a, like a little bit of a curl. Really, really cool. Black coral, $29.95. Sansevieria Sayuri for $29. Here we have black gold and superba black gold. Smaller Laurentii. Sansevieria Fernwood. They have a Sansevieria Cylindrica. So cute. Here we have some starfish ones for $11.95. Some more Fernwood. And then these cool little guys are Sansevieria um, Francisci. Francisci. And then just some other bird's nest options for $9.95. There is so much here. I'm definitely not gonna be able to show everything because this is just the first greenhouse. Yes, just the first greenhouse, but they have all sorts of cool stuff, like all sorts of spider plants hanging as well. Here we have some larger size rubber trees. These are $29.95, including the Tenneke. That's a nice size for $30. Ficus rubber altissima, absolutely beautiful. Here we have a Rojo Congo philodendron. Look at these leaves. So, so beautiful. I love how they're kind of like crinkly and so incredibly dark. Stunning. Here we have an Anthurium hukuri, hukuri. Really big. Ooh, beautiful Alocasia regal shields here for $21.95. Massive, and then look at the underside of that with that lime lime green with the veins of the plants, the sunlight shining through there couldn't be more beautiful. Here's a philodendron Congo. Beautiful green color and a really large Rojo Congo for 44. A nice selection of Monstera Deliciosas. They all look in really, really good shape and they are $27.95. I'm finding the prices here to be, you know, pretty good. All of these are beautiful, beautiful peace lilies. And then we have some uh, philodendron xanadu over here for $29.95, really cute. These are the most massive blue star fern I've ever seen. They are so, so healthy. And if you look close up on their leaves, I wanna show you. You can see where they create little seeds or little spores and it just gives a little extra detail to an already beautiful shaped leaf so so nice these are $21.95 look at this leaf back here isn't that stunning gosh look at that gorgeous and it is just like this beautiful blue mint color really really cool fern I love it looks like we have a lot of pothos options here we have some golden and some neon, some jade back there, marble queen pothos, pearls and jade over here, got some skindapsis pictus. This is silver Anne. You can see the variegation on the leaves, so beautiful and silvery. These are such easy care plants as well. Look at these cute heart fern back here. Always a favorite. I can't manage to keep mine alive only because I don't keep them moist enough. But if you're good at that kind of thing and you're good at, you know, staying on top of watering your plants, you know, these are easy. You just have to keep them moist and not let them dry out. And they're so, so cool. Look at the variegation on that, stunning. They have a lot of Adansonia here, $34.95 for this really, really large size plant all sorts of, um, <laughs> stumble on my words there, plant drunk as we call it, uh, beautiful Dracaena. Look at these ferns up here too, by the way. It's like walking through a jungle, I love it. Swiss cheese, or Adansonia, it looks like it's narrow form for $21.95. They have really huge totem options for 99. Gosh, look at this. This 
is the Raphidophora tetrasperma, super fast grower. It's called Monstera mini, but it's not the same plant as a Monstera. Has that really cool fenestration. Nice, small Monsteras over here for $19.95. Philodendron cellum, cel cellum, and Capel. <laughs> Beautiful, brightly colored Crotons. They're very, very popular here in North Carolina in the fall. Everyone loves to have them on their front porch with some mums and a pumpkin. So it just is a really nice compliment to the fall here. Look at these Symgonium. Oh my goodness, look at the size of these plants. I'm always really curious when I see a huge plant, the size pot, so that's a good size. And it's very root bound, like you can see the roots coming out there. But I think Syngonium actually likes that because these are very happy. Look at them. Incredible. This is another one of their greenhouses that has so much great stuff. Absolutely gorgeous, like begonias and I mean, all sorts of gorgeous tropicals. And they have all these trees here. And then they also have. In this section, I just came from in there <laughs> and I wanted to check out the back area, but they have all these cacti and succulents. So lots and lots of good stuff here. They have some more really large size Monstera here for 119 in just terrific shape. Really, really happy, healthy plants. And then we have a split leaf over here, another Monstera for 69, some smaller ones. Here we have some called eyelash begonias and they are 12.95. They have a lot of beautiful cane begonias, angel wing. I mean, absolutely stunning. Um, this is a torch pink begonia. How nice is that? Look at those flowers. Oh, so beautiful. This one's really pretty. This one's Linda Dawn. Really gorgeous, just cranberry red. Even darker than that. And look at the flowers it makes. So pretty. Wow. Look at these leaves. Look at that. <laughs> Isn't that beautiful? Ooh. These look kind of similar to the one I got recently at like Lowe's. It's always really interesting to see what types of little Rex begonias they have. How fuzzy that one is. It's really, really cool. I love the texture of it. I've just been lately seeing some, like, knock your socks off begonias here in Charlotte. I'm so impressed. Like, the nurseries here are just upping their game each time. Look at that. Oh my gosh. So, so beautiful. Even more cane begonias. They grow so well here. 
Here we have a pilea and some watermelon peperomias. These watermelon peps are $9.95. We have some purple waffle, some assorted syngoniums here, lemon lime dracaena, assorted diffenbachia, Wow, look at these nanooks. Oh, okay, I may have to get one of these and they're already potted up. That's really nice. I have one, but I just love the way the full plant looks. That's really pretty. How much are these? Hmm. I love them, they're so full. And that color is incredibly vibrant. All right, that's a maybe. Look at these um, cocodima that they have. I love all the different options they have. Plumosa, crocodile fern, maiden hair. I think this one might be my personal favorite, the staghorn in this cocodima. And I feel like this would be easy to water because you could just dunk it in a thing of water. It's $20. Maybe I'll buy that. All right, that's a maybe. They have one more over here. Look at that. That one's really nice as well. Hmm. There's so many things I'm interested in here. They always have a really, really gorgeous assortment of fern Lots of phytonias, polka dot plants, some more Tradescantia nanook, some really nice peperomias, peperomia rosso, frosted pep. Oh, wait, that's Napoleonite. Again, it's always helpful that they're labeled. Pilea peperomioides, piccolo. Shumi Red. I'm always interested to learn about all the different types of plants, so hope it's alright. I'm just naming them off. Peperomia obtusifolia, jelly. Looks like there's some variegated one here of obtusifolia. Nice variegation there. Peperomia cubensis. Gosh, peperomia everywhere. Silver squirrel, spider plant. Really, really nice. So here we have lots of string of dolphins for $14.95 and these guys are trailing and blooming. Look at them. Absolutely stunning. They have quite a few of them. Really happy. Lots of flowers coming out. Little dolphins <laughs> everywhere you look. They have some pretty interesting cacti. Um, these are $14.95. These Euphorbia, not actually cacti. They have some blue ones back there. They look pretty interesting for $15. Maybe they were some blue candle these are pencil cacti for $18.95. Some more gorgeous euphorbia for $18. Looks like some agave. Really pretty blue ones here. Look at this variegated apuntia. Isn't that nice? For $70. This one has a little bit of blue left on him. This is a really interesting plant. Look, it makes these little leaves. Is this the type of cactus? I'm not sure. I don't know anything about this one. You guys let me know. 
They're 21, or they range in price from 21 to 28. Some more cute little cacti here for a range of price. Madagascar palm. Quea Carnosa, just the regular jade ones for $19.95. We have some Hoya Retusa here for $17.95. Hoya Carii for $9.95. Got some nice speckled Pubacalyx for $24.95. Wow, some of them are very speckled. Look at that leaf. We have Crimson Princess. We got some Rick Rat Cactus over here as well. Nice. $34.95. Nice curly lipstick plant. Wow, I cannot believe how stocked they were. Oakdale was like, it hit it out of the park today. It hit it out of the park. I'm so excited to show you guys what I got. Um, it is plant haul time. Do you want to say hi, honey? You want to say hi to everybody? I have a little someone traveling around with me today on all my all my errands. It's my little my little nugget. Tricky Woo says hello to everybody. She is she loves loves love um, loves to ride in the car. Like if she could live in the car, she would. So. Now that it's nice cool weather, I like let her ride around with me all day. And she just is so excited every time. Aren't you honey? She's been having a little trouble with her eyes, so I'm taking her to the vet tomorrow. I mean, she's so old, like 14 years old. But uh, I think it's cataracts. So I'm going to see how she, what they can give her and just, you know, make her feel more comfortable because she is my child. <laughs> All right, let's do plant haul time. I cannot wait to show you what I got. <gasps> Love them all so much. They're, all three of them are really, really freaking cool. So let's do it. First up is this absolutely massive alocasia black velvet. As I mentioned, my last one got thrips and I so far have been fortunate that none of it spread to my other plants. And I just feel like the best thing to do right now is just to like keep it completely quarantined and I don't even know what I'm gonna do with it. So, but however, I'm obsessed with this type of plant because look how freaking beautiful it is. So when I saw this one for $20, look how humongous it is. This awesome purpley leaf is the brand new leaf coming out. Look how big it is. I am obsessed. The leaves on this plant are so, so velvety. The stems are really light colored. I've had a lot of success and luck with these plants as far as, you know, new growth and, and growing well and easy care. The only problems that I've had with this one is pests. So I'm gonna give it another run and I'm also going to use a new routine that I started for pest care, which I will share with you guys in a future video. Now I just have to figure out a pot situation for this. Maybe I'll put it in like a wicker basket or something. Like I think that would look nice, but the leaves are so dark and velvety and my husband will be really glad that we got another one. I never get to say that, so that's pretty exciting. This is the next one that I got. It is a Tratis Tratiscantia Nanook. And look at the color of those purple leaves. Look at the light coming through. I mean, oh, it's so, so beautiful. I cannot wait to just post a bazillion pictures of this. And it came in this really, really neat pot. Now, typically I don't go for decorative pots like this, but I just couldn't resist. I thought it went really, really well with the plant. Um, and this one was $29.95. And uh, to get a full pot of Nanook, as well as a neat pot like this. Look how pretty the flowers are. Like, maybe is it Japanese style? Why don't you wanna focus on this thing? Heron on there. And I just like the scene. And it has a cool um, drain, like a little drain pot with it. A saucer look at that heron on there I just think this pot is freaking cool like I can't wait to just stare at it all the time 
and this is the last one that I got it is a beautiful beautiful staghorn fern absolutely gorgeous these are relatively easy care um, I had a mounted one that I gave away because I was having trouble keeping that one watered enough. This is a cocodema and it's going to be a lot easier to water because I can just soak it when needed or spray it. And look at this. It is absolutely stunning. Um, I'm, I plan to hang it in my plant room. It's absolutely, absolutely beautiful. I'm so happy. I cannot get over how lovely this is. I mean, this was just the tip of the iceberg. There were so many plants in there that I was interested in. There were... Thank you so much for tagging along with me and for watching my content. It is so rewarding to put out videos for you guys each week and plant shop with you and share house planty things because even after doing this for so long, when I tell people about house plants and how much I love them and I show them my plant room, everyone thinks I'm crazy. And I just want to let you all know that I greatly appreciate you and your support and excitement. If you enjoy this kind of content, you know, please subscribe. I cannot wait to share some of my upcoming videos with you guys. This is the end of the video, so probably no one has uh, watched this far into it. But I just want to share this text message that I got last night from Fela with Must Love Plants. I know she has like an online shop where she does rare, she sells rare plants. So this is the text message that she sends to me last night. So I was thinking, I'm getting a large shipment of some pretty rare plants in this upcoming week, like Thursday. Strawberry Shakes, Florida Beauties, Variegated Perus, Variegated Adansonii, etc. Maybe we could do a little house and shop tour in the next week or two. Your viewers could look at some rare things that would be offered. I get to actually see some of these plants that I never thought I'd go my whole life and be able to see, like a Variegated Adansonii, a Variegated Peru, never seen a strawberry shake. I've only ever seen one Florida beauty. You guys would get excited if someone sent you that text message, right? I am done with my little spiel. Thank you for tagging along with me today. I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic rest of the day. I'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs>